you are getting ready to watch a video about safety procedures loading unloading on and around the bus we hope you enjoy it and you walk away learning something Bye. Bye. know how excited you are to get to school but as your bus is approaching its stop remember you should stand at least three feet away from the curb and are acting in a respectful and responsible manner waiting for the doors to open is very important as the driver may have to manage a safety concern in or around the bus practicing patience is key during this time if your stop requires you to wait across the street, you should still appropriately wait for the bus to come to a complete stop while standing at least three feet away from the curb. Then, look both ways to make sure it's safe before crossing the street. Here is an example of what not to do. It's a good thing you don't act like these kids. How many unsafe behaviors do you notice in this example? Count them. Then take a few moments to discuss as a group. Sometimes you might be required to ride a bus with seat belts. If you find yourself on one of these buses, make sure you practice the following. First, buckle the seat belt across your lap or waist area. Second, pull on the seat belt cord until it is snug on your body. Not too tight, not too loose. And third, leave the seat belt on until it is time for you to get off at your assigned stop. Here's a short video of what an appropriate bus ride should look like. Notice that all students are seated using calm voices, using technology appropriately, and keeping hands and bodies to themselves. As you can see from this video, there are a number of unsafe behaviors that have caused the driver to turn their focus away from the road, such as sitting inappropriately in a seat, yelling or using a loud voice, and moving around while the bus is in motion. Hey guys, sit in your seat right. What? How many times have I had to tell you to sit in your seat right? Really? Uh, seven times? One of the yeah. most significantly right. unsafe behaviors is arguing with the driver. Each time the driver has to redirect a behavior, their attention is off of the road. In this example, by the student's choice to argue with the driver, he is causing an unsafe situation for all of the students on the bus. Every time the driver takes his or her eyes off the road just to redirect a student, that is one more opportunity for a problem outside of the bus to occur. And nobody wants that.
When riding the bus to and from school, a student may want to pass the time by listening to music or playing a game on his or her phone or tablet. As long as you have permission from your driver and are being appropriate and safe, it is okay to do so. In this short video, you'll see a student being safe and appropriate by using headphones to keep the sound volumes down and maintaining the device only within his space. Here is a short video showing some unsafe and inappropriate technology use. Hey, what's going on? You guys need to settle down. Nothing, nothing. What's, what's happening? Nothing. We're uh, playing a game. What? Uh, that's not what it looked like. It looked like you were taking pictures. You're nope. not supposed to take pictures on the school bus. Put, put your iPad away. Put your iPad away. But I'm sorry. Other examples of inappropriate technology use while on the bus may include using loud audio volume without headphones, talking to people on the phone, or taking pictures or video of others. Never forget, taking pictures or videos of others can be a violation of that person's legal rights, and you may get into more trouble than just a bus referral. So be safe, and just don't do it. No matter what type of bus you ride, when you're getting in the bus, make sure to follow these students' model. Walk directly to your seat, sit down, remain in your seat, and be ready to head out for a safe trip home. Last, but certainly not least, is exiting the bus. Once you have reached your destination, it is time to say goodbye. Remember, the driver's job is to safely transport you and all of the other students to your destination. You play a big role in making sure everyone arrives at the destination safely. So let's make good choices as a passenger and never forget, thank your bus driver as you leave.